In this video, we are going to talk about what is reverse sneezing in dogs. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to this channel for our future updates. Have you ever heard of the phenomenon known as reverse sneezing? While both dogs and cats are susceptible to this illness, dogs are the ones who are more usually affected. For those of you who have recently had your dog diagnosed with reverse sneezing, or if your dog is making a peculiar noise that you can't quite put your finger on, you may be looking for further information. What is reverse sneezing? Paroxysmal respiration, often known as reverse sneezing, is a medical disorder that affects the respiratory system. In this disease, dogs rapidly suck in air instead of blowing it out, resulting in an effect that is nearly identical to a sneeze in appearance. Some dog owners are only aware of the condition as a result of the honking sound that is linked with it. Others may believe that their dog is having difficulty breathing while sneezing, when in fact, they are most likely reverse sneezing rather than trying to breathe. In any case, the first time you notice your dog doing this, it can be extremely distressing and may lead you to believe that they are having trouble breathing. Causes There is currently no recognized cause for backward sneezing in dogs, according to experts. Even if the problem was not caused by the disease in the first place, there are a variety of conditions that might make it worse, such as allergies. Some of the most common factors for reverse sneezing episodes are allergies to pollen and plants, among other things. Dogs may reverse sneeze as a response to these environmental conditions, rather than sneezing in response to them. Nasal lights can also play a role in the occurrence of reverse sneezing from time to time. If you believe your dog may be suffering from nasal mites, you should consult with your veterinarian to determine the best course of action. Dogs with long snouts are more prone to suffering reverse sneezing than other breeds of dogs, according to research. Any dog, however, has the potential to be affected by this problem either as a one-time occurrence or as part of a chronic reverse sneezing syndrome. If your dog is experiencing reverse sneezing, your veterinarian will need to examine him to ensure that the ailment isn't caused by something serious like a collapsed trachea, nasal tumors, or other similar issues. If all of these severe disorders are ruled out, your veterinarian may conclude that your dog is suffering from reverse sneezing due to an unknown cause. Is dogs reverse sneezing normal? A dog experiencing reverse sneezing can be frightening to observe, but it is not a hazardous Dude, ailment friend. and has no adverse consequences on the dog's health. Before and after the episode, the dog appears to be fully normal. During a reverse sneeze, the dog will exhale rapidly and for a lengthy period of time while remaining still and extending his neck and head. An audible snorting sound is made by the dog, which may seem as though something is stuck in its nose or throat. An episode of reverse sneezing might last anywhere from a few seconds to a minute. What you can do to help In the event that your dog is experiencing reverse sneezing, there isn't anything you can do to help him. For the most part, these episodes will be as inconsequential as a bout of ordinary sneezing, coming and going without causing any problems. If your dog appears to be distressed as a result of these occurrences, you can gently pet him to help calm him down. Don't pet him on the face or snout since he needs to be able to get through the sneezing episode without being distracted. Otherwise, soft caressing is an excellent approach to ensure that your dog is relaxed and does not panic while reverse sneezing is taking place. Except for caressing your dog, you'll just have to sit through the episode and wait it out. The majority of dogs will not be affected by reverse sneezing for more than a minute or two at the most. If this is the first time your dog has experienced an outbreak of reverse sneezing, you should take them to the veterinarian right once. This is not because the veterinarian is unable to assist you, but rather because you need to rule out any other possible causes of your symptoms. If your veterinarian determines that your dog suffers from reverse sneezing, you will not be required to take them back to the veterinarian every time the condition recurs. Just be aware that this will continue to be a part of your life with your dog in the future. If your dog suffers from reverse sneezing on a regular basis, your veterinarian may recommend antihistamines to alleviate the problem. Don't be alarmed if your veterinarian does not offer medication for your dog's reverse sneezing because this is a relatively uncommon treatment for the condition. This just indicates that your dog's reverse sneezing isn't severe enough to necessitate the administration of medication to alleviate it. If allergies are a key contributing factor to your dog's reverse sneezing, antihistamines may also be prescribed to alleviate the symptoms. In a similar vein, they may be prescribed a decongestant for the same type of cause as before. 
If you have any queries or concerns regarding whether or not your dog needs medication such as this, you should consult your veterinarian. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.